Let's make today R&B type beat, like Party Next Door, some kind of dark R&B. I always like to start with the bass, I mean, with the, with the chords. Chords! So... Something simple, like this. Let's record it. Alright, so we have those chords. Now, I want to make some kind of simple melody over it. Alright. Now I want to take those tonic notes of the chords, which are those lower ones. I'm going to copy this and I'm going to paste over this instrument right here. Let's put octave lower. Alright. I want to add a plugin right here, which will make some kind of this right here, the tremolator. I will put right here. I'm going to put other melody right here. Dun, 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 dun. Now I want to add a pad, I'm going to copy those chords, and I'm going to give a quick legato, and now I'm going to make a create automation clip, automation clip of volume, now the automation will be something like this. I mean, I need, I need to hear it. Yeah, it's cool. Let's make a vocal sample. I'm going to record something. Uh, um, yeah, 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 
right, we have this this vocal. We need to put a preset right here. And we need to put the auto tune on the right key, which will be D minor. EQ. And some delay, some reverb. We need to change this voice. Let's go to Stretch Pro and change the format. Let me hear it if I make this faster. I'm going to use the stretch to make it like this. Let's make some cuts on it. Alright, I like it. Now let's add the drums. Now we need to add the bass, and I think a good bass on it will be this bass right here. This bass. So I'm going to copy those notes right here, which are the tonic notes of the chords. And switch the octaves a little bit And if you want to learn more about making beats, about music production, there is my online course, first link on the description, you can check it out if you want to. And you can start right now because it's an online course, so check it out if you want to. Now, we need to structure the whole beat. So, let's make the intro. We need to make a longer intro. Alright, this is will be the intro. Right here is the chorus. Now, right here will be the verse and second part of the verse. We're going to mute most of the stuff on the verse.
repeat everything again on the chorus right here. So I think they're going to remove those vocals of the chorus. I will remove the vocals on the, on the chords so this will give more space to sing over it. Now I'm going to make the last chord. I think the last chords we can use the vocals. And this right here will be the outro. And now, I'm going to make a different bass for the verse. It'll be this bass right here. We are going to cut the bass every time the snare hits. So this will be the bass. And we got the beat done. Everything is finished. So if you liked, give it a like, subscribe to the channel. If you want to learn more about music production, about make beats, about making beats with me, there is my online course. First link on the description. You can start right now because it's an online course. So check it out if you want to. Now I'm going to play the whole beat. Mm -hmm.